Hey everyone, Active Learning here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to discuss the differences between artificial intelligence, machine learning, deep learning, and data science. So without further ado, let's jump right in. So imagine we're in the universe and we have this big blue giant circle. And in this circle, we have artificial intelligence or also known as AI. So what is artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence is basically any applications that can do its own tasks without human intervention. So we have Netflix, for example. Netflix recommends shows to you based on your previous uh, shows that you have, you have watched. And Tesla with their self-driving cars, for example, uh, those don't require any human intervention. And we also have Amazon, which recommends uh, items for you to purchase. And those also don't require any human intervention. And we also have Spotify with their music recommendation, right? Okay. And we have this huge orange circle within artificial intelligence, right? And you can say that this circle is around 90% of artificial intelligence. And this circle is what we call machine learning. I'm pretty sure you all know what machine learning is, but machine learning is basically using statistics tools to analyze the data, visualize the data, form predictions, make forecasting, clustering, and etc. right? Now, examples can be, you know, we are working with machine learning algorithms to predict certain prices, right? Uh, for example, predicting the price of Bitcoin, right, or Ethereum, or any crypto, even stocks, even though stocks don't work that well, right. But this really, uh, much, this is what machine learning is, right. We're analyzing the data, visualizing the data, making predictions, forecasting, and clustering, right. And this is ninety percent of artificial intelligence. And within machine learning, we have, boom. A yellow circle and this is called deep learning and deep learning is very popular right and in simple terms the main goal of deep learning is to mimic how humans learn right but it's not exactly how humans learn right for example we try to mimic how birds fly through the invention of airplanes and helicopters but that's not exactly how birds fly, right? We just try to mimic their way of flying, but it's not exactly how it works. And the same thing applies here with deep learning. We're not exactly mimicking how the human brain works, but we're trying to um, trying to learn the main ideas from how the human brain works so that we can apply it to coding. And Deep learning is mainly focused on multi-layered neural networks, right? We're using neural networks to make uh, predictions, making classifications, um, uh, classifying videos, images, um, and natural language processing, right? These are all part of deep learning. So now you might be wondering, so where does data science fall in? Well, let's see. Let's go back to our big world with machine learning as a subsection of artificial intelligence and deep learning as a subsection of machine learning. And let's see where data science falls in. Are you ready? Boom. Data science is, uh, it, data science contains all of artificial intelligence, some parts of machine learning, some parts of deep learning, right? So it depends on the job and work that you're given but sometimes you might need to use uh, a section of each of them, right? It, it highly depends on the work you're given, but as a data scientist, you're expected to know a lot of things, a lot of different things, such as uh, machine learning algorithms, deep learning algorithms, right? You're expected to know them so that you can use them on the job. And yeah, these terms are often really, uh, are often mixed up, but hopefully this video uh, was able to um, clear some of your doubts that you had about machine learning, AI, deep learning, and data science. 
And if you guys have any questions, please, please, please leave them down in the comments below and I will answer them as soon as possible. And soon, I think I'm going to start a deep learning playlist. So hopefully um, that can be very helpful as well. And if you guys found this video helpful, please subscribe and like this video. And thank you guys for watching. See you next time.